a dramatic rebound for Chinese stocks after Chinese top officials, including its president over the weekend, pledged their support for policy efforts to fuel its slowing economy. Beijing also unveiled new details behind its proposed income tax cut that the government says will boost household consumption. Just one of the several initiatives China has implemented to kickstart growth. In the past month, China has lowered its reserve requirement ratio to incentivize lending. Plus, it's restarted a number of infrastructure projects that had initially been delayed. Uh, Everbright's China team says the country has other economic tools at its disposal, including monetary easing and the purchase of ETFs to stabilize its stock market. Chinese stocks have rallied 7% since last Thursday, but China is still the worst performing major global market this year, due in part to trade uncertainty. That's why a number of investors, while pleased by the verbal intervention by Chinese leaders, are, they're still cautious on the stock market. Some are looking to the G20 summit next month and a potential meeting between President Xi and President Trump for more clarity as to whether we will get a trade deal before the end of the year.